Hello, my name is Spencer and I'm with Balif, and today we're going to be talking about our condition monitoring demo. So what we have here is a myriad of sensors and uh, technologies that can be used to uh, remotely monitor a process or uh, just anything going on in a plant floor. So starting at the, the top level here, uh, we have our IOLINK master. This is what's communicating back to your PLC via an Ethernet cable. Uh, and we have different masters for different protocols. So uh, we have uh, for one for Profinet, Ethernet IP, CC Link, all, all the major field buses. Um, and what we're showing here is just the connection and how you can easily connect to each device and get data uh, from them uh, to bring back to your PLC and use for any IIoT initiative. Um, so our IOLINK master is uh, IP67 rated, so it is machine mountable. Uh, that way you're saving cabinet space. And each port, uh, the wiring just uses a standard M12 connector uh, to save on wiring time. Our, our master is actually getting power from an IOLINK uh, IP67 power supply, which is unique to Balif. Uh, and with the IOLINK, you can actually get data about the stress level uh, and load level that the power supply is under, as well as the lifetime that it's been operating. Uh, again, just more clarity for any IOT initiative, you know, predictive maintenance. Okay, this power supply has been operating for, you know, 24 days and we need to change out a new one, whatever the case may be. Uh, and again, with it being IP67 and machine mountable, you're shrinking your cabinet space uh, just for that PLC, saving on costs. So going down to some of the devices we have connected, uh, right here we have our profile style BTL. These BTLs are custom made in uh, our headquarters in Florence, Kentucky, and can come in lengths up to 25 feet with different outputs from analog current, voltage, as well as IO-Link and field bus protocols. Uh, here, we have it actually hooked up to our smart light so you can get a visual indication of the position, uh, being notified of when uh, the position is reached for the desired application. Here, we're showing off our ADCAP photoelectric sensor, and ADCAP stands for Advanced Capabilities. So this sensor is actually a diffuse, a background suppression, retroreflective, and through beam sensor all in one. It is IO link, so uh, through the web server that is stored in the master, you can go in uh, and change the parameters to whatever the application is. You know, that way you're only using one part for different applications. Uh, and here it's actually counting uh, each hole as the wheel spins and it was connected to the smart light to give a visual reading uh, as to you know whatever the application may be that you're counting. Here we have another cylinder sensing uh, solution, our BMP. Uh, this is a magnetic field sen uh, sensor with continuous position feedback. It is IO link and uh, it's meant for uh, applications where you don't have as much space or uh, you just need uh, a shorter stroke length used. And the stroke lengths actually come from 32 millimeters to 256 millimeters. Uh, some more linear positioning uh, sensing that we have is our BIP. This is an inductive positioning sensor. So uh, again, an alternative to a BTL, if you just need a uh, measure the position of a ferrous material. You can actually see on our smart light, it's uh, detecting the position of the ferrous material as it goes by and uh, can come in a variety of lengths as well. Again, with a small form factor for those tight uh, fit applications. It is IO link, so again, you're bringing that data back to your PLC, which can be used to remotely monitor the position or say the stroke uh, on a cylinder is out of whack, you can go in and, and see that remotely. Here we have our pressure sensor. Uh, it comes with a variety of discrete outputs uh, with PNP or NPN and continuous measurement uh, outputs with analog current, voltage, or IO link. Uh, and as you can see here, we have it hooked up to our smart light. Again, 
just added visualization for uh, operators in the plant floor seeing the, the pressure on a tank or possibly just used for level measurement. And so what we want to get across here is uh, with IO-Link uh, and Balif IO-Link, you can easily monitor uh, the processes that are ongoing in your plant floor remotely. Uh, all of the uh, data from the webs, uh, I'm sorry, from the master block can be pulled back to the PLC via uh, a JSON uh, server and using a third-party software such as uh, Node-RED or Grafana, you can uh, create your own uh, visualization for that to see the ongoing processes in a plant. For more information, visit dollop.com.